Okay. Good morning. This is Ted Ellis, um, graduate candidate student at Southern University of New Orleans Museum Studies Program. And we're in for a treat. I'm here at the AKA Sorority um, Incorporated Regional Conference here in New Orleans. And just a rare, phenomenal moment that I have um, here today. I have Sora Betty. She's going to share with you some cultural um, history centered around the DeSable Museum. Take it there from there, Ms. Betty. Hi, I'm Betty Robinson. I am a member of Alpha Kappa Omega Chapter, Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority. And at the convention, I came and I looked at all the beautiful art and I had asked the gentleman, Mr. Ellis, had he ever been to Chicago and to the Sabo Museum? And he told me, yeah. Well, I would like to share with you my mother's, um, my uncle uh, Bernard Goss and, um, my goodness gracious, Margaret Goss Burroughs were founded the first African American museum in the United States. My Aunt Margaret was from St. Rose, Louisiana. And she, as a young child, went to Chicago to live with her parents. They all moved to Chicago, and she went to school and finished. And she became a teacher in, in, in high school and an art teacher. And she married my mother's brother, Bernard Goss, who was an artist in Chicago. And they founded the first uh, African-American museum. It was in a mansion that they called on the, I believe it was Michigan Bull